Welcome to your EMGM 105A EMT class. This is a short video on how to navigate through your class using the Canvas platform. When you first log into Canvas, you'll see these buttons down the left side here. All you do is click on the dashboard and that'll bring up all of the classes that you're registered for. Click on the appropriate class, the EMGM 105A course, and it will bring you up to a screen that looks like this here. Down the side, you have your home, announcements, syllabus, modules, discussion grades, and then conference in as well. This front page consists of your recent announcements. And then down below, it has a couple blue tabs here, which you can access your announcements, syllabus, modules, and grades. And then below, it has a short little welcome message from your instructor. And we'll talk about this here in just a few more minutes. Up on top, um, let's just click on the announcements buttons. Every day I would ask you to log in and look at this because this is gonna be where your instructor posts information that you all need to know. It kind of starts with the most current and then down below all the way to the, the first announcements that they've posted. Make sure you click on these and read these as this will be the most current information um, coming from your instructors. Next, we have our syllabus. Important that you um, look and read the syllabus. And then also below it, you have the schedule. Um, and I'll just show you, click on the schedule. It'll populate down below here. And this is what it gets. I would tell you um, to maybe download this or have it handy because throughout your class, this will tell you exactly what you're responsible for when you have your quizzes and so on. Your instructor will spend more time going over this with you in class. Probably the most important button here is the modules button. Click on the modules button. And this is really how your course will start. All of these things here need to be done in order. And you'll see it starts out with a couple assignments here. It's got module one. We have a quiz, module two, and so on, all the way through class. Important to know that this stuff has to be done in order. So you can see here, it's kind of grayed out. I can't click on these because I haven't done the first one. So let's walk through this to make sure that everybody understands what we're doing. If we click on this first button here, it's going to go ahead and um, give you the student learning and outcomes and objectives. Read through this. Okay, you can see exactly what we're going to do, what you're responsible for. And then what you want to do is up in the top right corner, you're going to see this little button here that says Mark has done. Click on that and it turns green. Down here at the bottom, you now have a little next arrow. You can click on next. And then we go to the next assignment. We'll read through this. This tells us how to navigate through the modules. And then what you're going to do is you're going to go back up here. We're going to click on done and continue on to the next section and so on and so on. So let's just take a look at what happened out here with our modules. Okay. So you can see over here on this side here, now that it's updated, I have little green arrows by the modules that I've completed. And it shows me where I need to continue as my code of ethics and cheating. Okay, so that will be the next assignment that I'll complete. Right up here at the top, you'll notice that it has a little um, red circle there. Once you complete all of the assignments in there and everything's done, this will actually turn green. So make sure that you look at this. Sometimes people have problems and they don't know if they've completed the module. Well, if you look at this button and it's still red, that means that one of these things needs to be completed. Go back and find whatever assignment isn't done, complete it, hit mark is done, and then that button will, can, will uh, turn green and you'll be able to continue on with your assignments. Let's go back to the home page here. So down on the home page, 
um, down here at the bottom. There's another, here's the same video that you're getting here. It's gonna show you how to um, navigate through this course. And then it also has some um, links down here. It's got parking directions, how to log in, all these little helpful links that we put here for you. Make sure you guys click on those and read those. Um, one, two of the buttons that I'd like to talk about is just um, this one here. How can you get Canvas on your mobile device? So you can actually download it to your phone and then um, you'll be able to do and complete these assignments pretty much from um, your device wherever you're at. The other button here is the parking directions and map. Make sure you click on that and that'll show you where to park um, and then directions to our location um, here at Miramar College. That is really it for um, this tutorial. We look forward to see you, seeing you all in class and um, good luck to y'all.